Hello students, today you are going to learn about milliliter and liters. Before we start, can you tell me how many milliliters are in one liter? I know, one liter is equal to thousand milliliters. Absolutely right. With this rule in mind, can you tell me how many milliliters are in two liters? Two thousand milliliters. Excellent. Okay, then tell me how many milliliters are in a quarter liter. Hmm, is the answer 250 as that is the quarter of a thousand? Correct, and can you tell me what is this in liters? 0.25 liters as this is the quarter of one. Yes, good. Then what is half liter equal to? 500 milliliters or 0.5 liters. Well done. What about three quarter of a liter? Is it 750 milliliters or 0.75 liters? Right. How many milliliters are in the beaker below? Hmm. It is in the middle of 1700 milliliters and 1800 milliliters. So the answer is 1750 milliliters. Correct. So what will be the answer in liters? Since 1000 milliliters is equal to 1 liter and 750 milliliters is equal to 0.75 liters, then we will add both of them together to get 1750 milliliters, which is 1.75 liters. Well done. Let's look at the place value of the number that is 1.75 ml. Now let's look at the water container. When the water is poured into one liter beakers, this is how it looks. Can you tell me the capacity of the liquid in terms of liters and milliliters? It holds 2 liters and 850 milliliters. Yes, good job. Now let's try something different. The barrels below hold 1.5 liters of oil and 100 ml of oils respectively. Which barrel holds more oil? The one on the right, as 100 is a larger number than 2. That's not correct, because you always have to convert both quantities to have the same units before you compare the two numbers. Uh-oh, I didn't see that they have different units. The barrel on the left holds 2000 milliliters that is greater than 100, so this barrel holds more oil. That's correct, very good. Let's look at another example. There are two juice bottles. The one on the right holds 1.3 liters and the other holds 1300 milliliters. Which bottle contains more juice? Hmm, if we convert 1.3 liters to milliliters, then it will be 1300 milliliters. This is equal to the amount of the juice in the other bottle. So they both contain the same amount of juice, right? Absolutely correct. Good work today students. You have learnt about milliliters and liters. Now please complete the polling practice exercises and send in your work through Google Classroom. See you next time. Bye.